just so pure. I'm just getting home and Miss Dolce wants to play. She wants to play. Mm. Aussie water in the plants, as per usual. Come on, give me that, give me that ball. Come on, baby. Hello, ducks. Come on, let's go see. Come on, come on. Good boy, baby girl. Okay. I just never get tired of looking at this combination of purple and yellow. It's just gorgeous. Mm. Come on, guys. Give me this ball. Are you ready? Sit. Sit. Dolce. Sit down. Go get it. Get it, girl. I was just like, uh, yeah, you go ahead and get it, Dolce. I'll stand back here. <laughs> Good girl. Oh, well, today, y'all, oh, it is 104 degrees outside, 104 Fahrenheit. Come on, now. Come on, let's go see. So, come on. Oh, it's a hot one. Come on this way. Oh, yeah. It's a hot one. Yeah, I'm waiting for this gladiola. You know what? This one's about to bloom. This is gonna be my gladiolas. It's gonna be gorgeous. Row of, row of gladiolas. Right there. They're ready to go explore the backyard. Come on, Wapa. Oh, wrong way. Come on this way. See what we can see. Whew. Hot tamale. Oh man, that sun just hits you. Come on, Oz. Although, um, you know, there's some shady spots in here, so it's a, it's a really big. Uh, temperature gradient you know if you like right here under the under the trees actually not bad at all but boy when you get out there in that open sun that'll hit you pretty hard uh checking on these sunflowers still not ready but almost Ready. Here they come. Ooh, let the dogs out. Ooh, baby girl. Come on, guys. Come on, Tux. Tux is moving a little slow today. Uh, he stays outside most of the day. Tux does. Uh, so he's probably a little feeling a little slow, a little uh, lethargic today, it looks like. Come on, Tux. Okay, Papa. Let's go see. Let's go see. Don't 
Archie. Let's see what we got. Oh yeah. Let me show you this one. That's my plumeria. Yeah. We got the plumerias finally blooming. Lantana. Lantana is loving the heat like it does. This one just. This one I think is one of my favorites, that Portulaca. And uh, that's a little rose is blooming too. He's like, you come on. I'm ready to go inside. All righty. That's my Queen Anne palm. And these beauties uh, just steal the show every time. Beautiful hibiscus. Okay, guys. Okay, y'all. Well, we're going to get inside and get in that cool AC. And I will I'll catch y'all later. Oh, yeah. This is the uh, that's the doggy door. You see, that's how they go in their doggy door. Go on. Go on. Go on, baby girl. So, it's, uh, it's pretty secure because it, it's only... Uh, it op only opens with their uh, with their with their a little decal on their collar. So, what I like about this doggy door is that uh, see it closes by gravity. So, um, so that you know if, if the dog stands in the middle there, it won't close on them and hurt them. It just gently rests on them, and so. Uh, so anyway, I love that doggy door. Uh, it's also a tight, it closes tightly so that other critters can't get in. You know, like the the ones that flap, you know, flap open, close it. Those aren't as secure because ro rodents, you know, or any other critters can get in, raccoons. So yeah, I've had that one from house to house and I had somebody help me to uh, I just bought that door. It's a wooden door. I had someone help me cut, make a cut out and, and uh, insert the doggy door. But uh, I can do more video on that later. But anyway, y'all have a good night and I'll talk at you guys later. And Ozzy said bye. I said bye, guys. Say bye, Papa. Okay, talk to you guys later.